technology firms, film studios, producers, and TV stations. The Hong Kong international film and TV market kicks off on March the 18th at the city's convention and exhibition center. The organizer, Hong Kong Trade Development Council, says the four-day event has drawn more than 8,700 visitors, up 9% from last year. Exhibitors from diverse fields have come to the fair with various purposes. So, what is on their agenda? This animation maker and distributor from Guangzhou says he attends the film art every year. The organizer says this year's film art sees record high exhibitor participation from mainland cities and provinces. Both Hong Kong and overseas traders have expressed their readiness to join hands with their counterparts from mainland China. Even though we focus on Hollywood movies, we also interested in China market because the movie industry is growing each year, and we can see that they're producing a lot of movie. 大陸嘅參展商唔係我哋競爭對手啦，因為佢哋都有好多地方俾我哋學習嘅。咁誒，希望可以同佢哋成為一個誒合作嘅夥伴啦。A representative from Thailand's Ministry of Commerce says his country wants to reach out and be part of the growing Chinese market. Obviously, China is becoming an increasingly important market. The big advantage of film art is that it really is a gateway, not only to other Asian countries and the world, but in particular to China. The 2018 Hong Kong Film Art has attracted over 800 exhibitors from all around the globe, mostly from mainland China, Hong Kong, and other parts of Asia. The organizer says the event is intended to promote Hong Kong as an international hub for TV, movies, and entertainment. Some exhibitors say they hope to leverage Hong Kong's visibility and competitiveness in the industry to promote their businesses and seek collaboration. Vince Chen reports, Hong Kong.